Till now we have studied the importance of agriculture. Now we are going to study the features of Indian agriculture. Under features, first is low productivity. Productivity means output per hectare of land. Output per hectare of land. And Indian agriculture has low productivity. Here is the you know comparison of the different countries. Crops can be many. We have taken two. First is rice and wheat. Rice, that is the output of rice in India per hectare of the land and it is in tons. In India it is 3.6 and in China it is 6.8 and in Vietnam it is 5.8 and world average is 4.5. As compared to these averages, the uh, comparison uh, you can see that Indian productivity is much less as compared to other countries. Same as under wheat. In India it's 3.1, in China 6.5 and Vietnam it's 9. And the uh, world average 3.3, still India is having 3.1 as average. And it is the productivity which shows that India is lagging behind and uh, the production uh, is less as compared to the other countries. Next is the disguised unemployment. Disguised unemployment can also be called as a hidden. Hidden unemployment and hidden uh, employment is also the feature of uh, Indian agriculture. Disguised unemployment means uh, people see that they are actually working, but in actual uh, case they are unemployed. Means even uh, productivity will not be affected even if they are removed from the work. And in ag Indian agriculture, uh, on the fields. More people are working instead of the required people. So this is also the cause that under uh, Indian agriculture, disguised unemployment is present. Next is the dependence on the rainfall. Indian agriculture highly dependent on the rainfall. If good rainfall is there, then production is good. If uh, bad rainfall is there, then uh, production will also be the bad. So production uh, of the Indian agriculture is uncertain because uh, of the dependence of the rainfall because the proper irrigation facilities are not available for the Indian farmers. Next feature is the subsistence farming. Subsistence uh, farming uh, oriented agriculture India is having and uh, the farmer of the India mostly they think about the subsistence means who need uh, of the family and they, uh, they are not focused on the commercial needs and uh, they don't think about the profit. That is why the investment in agriculture is not there uh, and this is the reason of the stagnation of Indian agriculture. Next is the lack of modern inputs. Lack of modern inputs means farmers of India are not having the modern inputs like chemical fertilizers, insecticides or pesticides. They are beyond the reach of the farmers uh, because of the source, source to uh, have the same. And this is the reason that Indian agriculture is backward. Next is the small holdings. Small holdings means the size of fields are uh, small enough. And uh, with the small size, this is the problem that use of machine be becomes very difficult. Machines cannot be used for the small uh, holdings or small fields because the cost of operating machine is high and the productivity that is much less. So that is not affordable. And there are few farmers who are uh, who are not having the large holdings, who are having the small holdings. They uh, think the farming as a source of food, I mean subsistence farming only. They are not ready to uh, sell the product if extra uh, products of agriculture is available. So this is the reason that the small holdings are also uh, the problem uh, for the Indian agriculture. Next is the landlord and the tenant conflict. In India there is always the presence of conflict between the landlord and the tenant. Because tenants are the people who are actually doing farming on the farms and the owner they usually get the rent from the tenants. 
and uh, landlords enjoy the high position and they take a regular uh, interval of the uh, rents and uh, the tenants they have a very small share always to for the survival of their life that is the reason that the surplus is not left with them for the uh, benefit or for the betterment of the soil this uh, leads the uh, field or the uh, this leads the field or the agriculture as stagnant and backward next we have is the backward technology technology used in agriculture in india especially that is backward because a uh, small farm size is available for indian uh, farming working uh, population and farmers are also poor these uh, two are the basic reason that farmers are compelled to have backward technology indian farmers generally dependent on the cattle power not on the man power and the use of the modern harvester machines or the tractors this is the basic reason for the india to have agriculture as backward and in the conclusion along with the features we can say that indian agriculture is the backward agriculture and still efforts uh, are done by the government but the results are not uh, so good and uh, the primary sector which is the basic sector the uh, agriculture sector that is known as the uh, you know backbone of the indian economy that is back what it means indian economy is a struggling economy to overcome the problem 